Hey everyone, let me throw a curveball your way. What if I told you that the secret to financial freedom isn't just about saving money, but also about knowing when to spend it? I'm Vyacheslav, a proud alumnus of Chicago University with an MBA to boot, and today we're tackling a topic that's as essential as it is misunderstood. Savings versus splurging, a balanced approach. I'm here to guide you through the maze of managing your money, helping you understand when to pinch pennies and when to let loose a little, all while solving the everyday problems that come with it. First, savings, the stepping stone to security. Imagine this, you're seven years old again and you've got your first piggy bank. Every coin you drop in it feels like a victory, right? Fast forward to adulthood and the principles don't change. Saving is about securing your future, one dollar at a time. But it's not about hoarding every penny under the mattress. It's about wise choices like emergency funds that act like a financial safety net for those just-in-case moments. Second, splurging, the art of rewarding yourself. Now let's flip the coin. Picture a retired person finally booking that dream vacation. That's splurging with a purpose. It's rewarding yourself for the hard work you've done. And here's a fun fact. Did you know that occasionally treating yourself can actually fuel your saving habits? It's all about balance. Third, balancing act, the middle ground. Let me hit you with a scenario. You've been eyeing a top-of-the-line laptop. You've saved up, but it's pricey. Do you take the plunge? Here's where the balance comes in. Consider the value it adds. If it boosts your productivity, it might just be worth that splurge. It's about investing in things that give back to you, whether it's through utility, happiness, or growth. Now, don't check out yet because I've got a question for you. Have you ever bought something on a whim and then found out it actually benefited you in the long run? Share your stories in the comments. I'll be reading. All right, let's wrap this up with a neat little bow. Today, we've uncovered that the golden path to financial well-being isn't just about saving. It's about strategic spending, too. Remember, the goal isn't to fill a vault like Scrooge McDuck. It's to create a life that's rich in experiences and stability. If you're nodding along and find these tips handy, why not hit that like button and subscribe? Your support helps me create more content that makes finance fun and approachable for everyone. And that's a wrap on savings versus splurging, a balanced approach. Stay sharp, because our next video will keep this money conversation going strong with creating a personal finance calendar, key dates and deadlines. Stay tuned.